Today we'll be talking about brain aneurysms. One of the questions I'm often asked is, what is a brain aneurysm and why do we care about brain aneurysms? Let me draw a brain aneurysm here. So these are the blood vessels of the brain. And typically, brain aneurysms form at a branching point of the blood vessels. This would be the aneurysm here. Blood flows up the blood vessel and typically branches at this fork in the road. And because of the blood coming up here, we think this is one of the reasons why aneurysms form. The reason we're concerned about aneurysms is for the potential for them to cause bleeding in the brain. Obviously, bleeding in the brain is a very serious thing. It can make people very critically ill. One of the things we do as neurosurgeons is treat brain aneurysms to prevent them from rupturing down the road. One of the oldest and maybe the most durable solutions for treating brain aneurysms is called aneurysm clipping. This approach involves an incision on the scalp of a patient. We remove a very small bony opening to expose the brain and we dissect down to the aneurysm so we can see the aneurysm from the outside. Once we see the aneurysm and we see all the various arteries in relation to the aneurysm, we then apply a titanium aneurysm clip to the aneurysm like this. The tines of the clip will go across the aneurysm and effectively pinch it shut. The reason this is such a durable solution is that when this is pinched shut, blood cannot get past this clip or get into the aneurysm, and the aneurysm is effectively cured. More recently, we've had advances in our field that have made this a more minimally invasive approach. And the way we do this is by placing small catheters or tubes from the arteries in the groin all the way up to the arteries of the brain. These tubes are very small, and we can navigate up all the way through the blood vessels and actually into the aneurysm. When the tube or catheter is in the aneurysm, then we place very small platinum aneurysm coils into the aneurysm. They're almost like fine pieces of hair. These coils coil up in the aneurysm, and we can place many coils into the aneurysm in order to fill the aneurysm and effectively blocking all the blood flow from getting into the aneurysm. We then remove the catheter and the coils stay in place. You may ask, well, what if the opening of the aneurysm is very large? If that's the case, it may be hard to keep the coils in the aneurysm, and the coils could effectively fall out of the aneurysm and cause stroke. So one trick we have is we can actually place an aneurysm stent. And we place the stent in the artery of the brain across the opening of the aneurysm, and this creates a shoulder to help keep the coils into the aneurysm. We can discuss what aneurysm treatment is most appropriate for your aneurysm in your initial clinic consultation.